Hi, I'm Michael from Catalyst, and I want to help you a little bit with motivation. And I want you to ask yourself this question. How often are you consistently highly motivated? You know, when you're feeling like, yeah, let's go. I'm, I'm feeling good. I'm motivated. I want to do this thing. Feeling happy, feeling raring to go, full of energy. And just think about that. Is it quite a few hours in the day? Is it kind of a fleeting thing that comes and goes, maybe a few minutes? Does it depend on your feelings? Does it depend on how well things are going for you? And I ask this question of a lot of people. And here's a stat for you. There's 168 hours in a week. 168, 24 times 7. And imagine, obviously, you sleep for some of those. But ask yourself, of, say, 100 of those hours, how often are you feeling highly motivated? You know? How often are you feeling, yeah, let's go, let's go? And if you're anything like most people, they usually answer me and they say, well, sometimes. And that's all, how many hours, you know? So you could think about that. You could write it down. You could jot it down and say, how many hours am I actually highly motivated? But what you'll find is... Nobody says all of the time, and we shouldn't expect ourselves to. Nobody is highly motivated all of the time. But then I think, well, why not? You know, why not? And then the question to then think is, well, how do I become more consistently motivated? And the answer is, you need a process. I've created a process. I've used processes for many years. I've used lots of different processes, and I'm sure you do as well. You know, for your sales, your marketing, your business development, everything you do, even health health and fitness looking after your body and all these different things we have processes we even have a process for brushing your teeth or driving a car so the question becomes if you want to be highly motivated have you got a process in place and if you're anything like most people they go no <laughs> well that's that's where i can hopefully help you so this process is called the five types of motivation and i've trained people in motivation for over 10 years now and i've trained thousands of people and the same things come up and everybody needs a process everybody needs a series of steps that you can rely upon no matter how you feel or think in the day that you can rely on and say, if I do that, I'm going to get that. And that's what the process is. It's called the five types of motivation. So don't expect yourself to feel highly motivated all the time because you've probably not got a process in place. You just need one. So if you're interested in that, you think, well, that sounds interesting. I think that could help me in my life. Just click on the link below. You can find out more about the five types of motivation. But just remember, you don't need to consistently feel good all the time. There's no pressure. Just need a bit of a process.